I would now like to ask Kelly Bridgel Reyes, representing the undergraduates from the classes of 2020 and 2021, to give her valedictory address. Provost Whitelaw, distinguished guests and participants, fellow students, families, and friends, I am honored to address you today on behalf of the graduating students. Bonjour, c'est un grand honneur de m'adresser à vous aujourd'hui. Thank you to my mom, dad, brothers, grandparents, and boyfriend for your love and support. To my friends, colleagues, and lab mates for the fond memories. To my TAs, professors, advisors, and mentors for your time, energy, and belief in me. Thank you. I'd like to use this time to share three valuable experiences that shaped me during my time at Concordia and since. The Science College, in which students from different disciplines discuss topics across scientific fields, highlighted for me the importance of recognizing the unique talents and perspectives of my multidisciplinary colleagues. In our memorable first course together, we role played as cardinals and mathematicians to debate the validity of Galileo's claims. Broaching the same topic from our different backgrounds expanded our understanding. Our cohort planned and produced the college's 40th anniversary gala and inaugural Bold Science Conference, which truly showcased the talents and dedication of each student involved. I'm indebted to each of my colleagues for enriching my perspective by helping me see science and the world through their different lenses. I was fortunate during my time at Concordia to have been guided by positive mentors who encouraged me on numerous occasions. I'm grateful to the professors, advisors, and fellow students who offered advice and support along the way. For example, the Co-op Institute has given me many opportunities to both give and receive mentorship, and I'm still regularly in touch with my Co-op mentor. We need to reach for opportunities, surround ourselves with people who believe in us and build us up, and pay it forward by building up those around us. I just returned from a trip to Iceland where we were greeted by near gale force winds and violent rain that trashed the tents of our fellow campers. Afterwards, although we were drenched to the bone, we were blessed with the most brilliant rainbows. Similarly, over the years, I've struggled with imposter syndrome, been burdened with anxiety, and have felt completely lost. Our graduating cohort is defined by our adaptability to the COVID era during our university studies our persistence and determination to continue to learn despite isolation, uncertainty, and instability. We've leapt into the next stages of our lives in a different world than both previous and future graduating classes. I'm certain that you can relate to my struggle to find the right working environment due to interviews being conducted over Zoom, the difficulty of making new friends when everyone is shielded by masks and computer screens, and the mental health issues stemming from lockdowns, curfew, and solitude. Despite it all, we have all found our way, taken root, and are growing into new versions of ourselves. It's worth celebrating not only our accomplishments during our time at Concordia, but also the storms which we have weathered since. Take pride in your struggles, and remember that even if life throws a storm your way, there might be a beautiful rainbow at the end of it. I have many fond memories from my time at Concordia. Walking into an exam room while a, a classmate was still cramming chapter two, my lab mate spilling a valuable chemical on the dirty lab bench and scooping it up, citing the five second rule, <laughs> launching an epic prank war across the Science College office space. However, nothing will beat the feelings of acceptance and support by my peers, professors, and advisors who always encouraged me to grow into the best version of myself. We have something special here at Concordia, our determination, our cooperation, and our appreciation of each other's talents. As we all move forward in our lives, I wish each and every one of us success, health, and happiness. Merci, et je vous souhaite une vie pleine de succès.